Earlier today, I was at the gym working out and uh, during my rest period, I took out my phone like I usually do. Bad habit, don't do that if, if this is you. Like don't, don't use your phone during workout. And I was scrolling through it and I saw this photo and uh, I hit double tap because uh, I really like the style of uh, Diljit nowadays, like the beard. And uh, I know he's doing this movie about just one saying cholera, which is like, really excited to see this movie so when i saw this picture i went into his profile and i started scrolling and i was scrolling all the way down to when i saw this photo right here and i was like damn like that's a good looking turban and i want to try this style so that's what we're gonna do today but first i need to analyze his turban and see like if i can find any other videos and I asked my wife and she was like, that's from a music video that he did. And as you guys can hear, like I'm not the best in knowing what's happening in the Punjabi music industry. But I do know that this guy is an actor, both for Hollywood and Bollywood. No, not Hollywood maybe. He does nice Punjabi movies and stuff like that. Like in Nakata Manupada. I'm gonna quickly analyze his pug from looking at this photo. I can see that he has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 larts. And as you can see on my bug right here, it's just 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So it's double. However, it doesn't look that big. So what I think that he has done is using a longer bug than mine, obviously. But I think it's much smaller in width as well. And that's why it doesn't look huge. Uh, so right now I only have a photo of one side. I'm not sure how he has done on the other side But I don't think it's much different from this one. First of all, I need to find a bug that is longer than this one right here So um, as you can see I have a lot of bugs So what I'm looking for here is a bug that I usually have for my Dumala because they are quite long and small in width i'm gonna go with this one right here it's uh red maybe like vin red in svenska i don't know what it is in punjabi uh, but it's not red it's not purple it's somewhere in the middle so i need to look at how long it is and i'm gonna measure it to this style are you ready for it? So one, two, three-ish, four, five, six. There we go. And the width is not that much. I would say, uh, oh, perfect. Is 50 centimeters, Pia centimeters. Now you got it in uh, Punjabi too. What we need to do is we need another person, so I'm gonna borrow my wife and I'm gonna start to do a puni. Let's go. The puni is done and I also ironed it actually because I usually use this pack as a damala and when I do that, like, Bala bop and there like it's it's not like when you're gonna do this style of bug It's gonna always be easier if you iron it because if you look at the lars right now It's so clean and the, the cleaner they are the easier it's gonna get to tie your turban So I definitely recommend to iron it if penla bop Otherwise you might make it work. Let's start making that Diljit pug style So I'm gonna start with my keski and I have jura like normally very loose at the top, my kanga at the back, moving on to the keski and now when I look at the shape of the triangle that he has I can see like one is very like straight and the other one is going like round something like this. So I'm gonna start with my keski just at the, sh the shape of his pug so I don't get any, any trouble with, with my keski showing underneath. So just something like this, I think, up and then round-ish like that. I can fix it later, but I think I'm gonna go for that for now. And then just bring everything at the front, like 
I normally do and just go round now this one is too short but who cares I'm just a case key that I'm having underneath that you won't see okay so I'm gonna go for that I think that's good this one I'm gonna bring it a little bit closer and then go with my pug just like that so can you see like it's has like a weird shape that's how he does it now I don't think there's a lot of difference from his technique and mine uh, I just think like a, a small thing like his his pug seems to be more round than mine mine is more like pointy and I look at his lard they go like round and my, my go straight and they go round so I think that's the biggest difference that I'm gonna try to do start somewhere like this so clo close to my eye just like him and then from here So we're going around and hopefully so as you can see I just started and I just went like like a half circle Okay, doing this doing the same thing again starting just a little bit above yeah I think so Like, of course, I can't get it exactly like him, but at least so we can understand his style. Okay, I think I think we're getting close. All right. You guys, we're getting close. Not sure if this is how he does it, but I would say we're we're almost there. I have no idea how it looks at the back, but I'm just gonna go with with um, with how you usually do it, and ho hopefully that's how he does it. All right, you guys, this is the closest that I could get to his pug style right now, and I don't know. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Is it is it even close? I think the difference is that his pug is much longer than mine. Like I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine lard, and he has twelve. 
And I also think that his bug is a little bit wider than mine because mine look quite small even though it was was it six meters? I can't remember. This is the closest I get. And if you like this style, uh, try it out and let me know in the comments below what you think about it. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoy it. And if there's any other bug style that you think that I should try out, let me know in the comments below and I will try it in the next video. Like this video and subscribe if you aren't already. And I will see you guys in the next one.